I definitely like to see myself as a Crow woman warrior. I want to be a role model that shows anyone can do it, you know, and that there is help on a reservation for those that have fallen. The ultimate warrior race is during the Crow Native Days. At the beginning of the ultimate warrior race, we run two miles and then canoe at the river. We did a four and a half mile run in between the canoe and the horseback, so we actually ran up here behind us on this hill. The horse part was a little nerve wracking, like with the practicing and the horses kind of being spooky a little, but you know, I was so focused in the race. The Abzaloga people started what they call the Ultimate Warrior Challenge, and that is a big event, and that has uh, attracted a big crowd. The youngsters love it, the elder people love it. The idea of a, a person, and you, you put the word ultimate warrior, that almost takes you back to the intertribal warfare days, the buffalo days. Personally, I've you know gone through some hardships or adversity growing up, and you know I had my mom there with me and my great grandmother Elizabeth to guide me. But on my own, you know, I had to learn also how to get through those and whether the negativity that comes onto the reservation. I've seen it, and I know what it can do. You know, the destructiveness of it, and I lost my father when I was a sophomore in high school. You know, there's grief that I've gone over, the fear. It's especially hard on a, a children once, say, a parent was uh, consumed in alcohol. And you can just imagine how the feelings of that child growing up. My father is Crow and my mother is not. This was the only place they chose to raise us. And so it was with the understanding of having that strong identity of knowing who I am and where I'm from. The value of that healthy living is even more prominent when we have young ladies such as Brittany in the community who are, who are living that healthy and positive lifestyle of going after her education, of working with the youth, and of being an ultimate warrior. It makes me happy to know my sisters have those outfits that I've worn when I was younger. It reminds me of my great-grandmother, Elizabeth White Fox, being around and the things that she has taught us and instilled in us. I want to be a role model to show them that anything is possible. As far as my daughter is concerned and, and being in a healthy relationship now where I can raise my daughter, now our daughter is to the point of where she idolizes Brittany in terms of, well, I want to be like her and be an ultimate warrior. My goal for myself would be to keep living on this positive road, keeping the tradition alive and doing what I love to do, you know, running and doing rodeo, staying close with my family. Our tradition will help people stand in a positive way, not going on a destructive path by remembering our elders, where we come from, where we started. We're not meant to live in a negative way.